truth, gang, gang, it's your girl, Omega, aka Asha Israel, and I'm always bringing that truth, you know how I do. If you guys are new here, welcome, welcome, welcome. If you guys are not, you already know what to do, you know to spew. Let me grab it. Hashtag justice for Alicia Smiley 2024 off into the comment section. Your girl will surely appreciate it. Today, we have something a little different from you got for you guys. We are going to do a reaction video. We will be reacting to Chris Stapleton's Think I'm in Love With You, the official music video. The song is a great song. It is an awesome song. I feel like I've connected with this song, like spiritually. Music is so powerful and it's able to move the soul. So I wanted to share this with my tribe because I'm sure you guys are going to enjoy this video just as much as I have enjoyed this video. So we're going to look at his video from a spiritual aspect. Honestly, you guys, the video is what made me like the song. The song just adds to the video. They could have made the video without the song and I still would love the video because of the the visuals that, that they give and because we are a spiritual channel I do want to break this down spiritually for you guys um everybody may have their own individual interpretation of this particular video and the spiritual breakdowns of the video but we're going to get my personal spiritual interpretation on this music video and also how um you know um how I can see the signs, how you read the matrix, okay? How I can see the signs in this music video. And I think it's just the most awesomest thing in the world. So, uh, yeah, let's get started, okay? Let's go. Okay, so we're going to pause there and we're going to react to just that little bit. It's only 30 seconds, 36 seconds in, but from the jump of the video, we're already in some spiritual uh, energy. This guy is at a crossroads between life and death. He has his family surrounded around him and he is now exiting the physical realm and going back into the ether realms. So that's what you're going to see. You're going to see him looking at that light, going towards that light, though we know spiritually you ain't supposed to go towards that light, but that's where he's going, okay? Um, and then he realizes that he's out of his body when his feet hit the ground, and then he's double-checking to make sure that he's really gone and he's really on the other side. He looks at himself, and then he stomps his foot and he's stomping his foot to cause some type of reaction in the ether realm. So basically he's checking to make sure that he is now back into the ethers. When the light flashes and he sees it, he now knows that he's in the ethers again. And he's really excited. Let's keep going. Baby, you ever wonder? Oh, you might wish things could change. I know this might sound strange. Okay, that right there, what you guys saw, he was just at the crossroads, okay? So he's died now, he's crossed over, and this is his soul, okay, that we're seeing right now. Notice that his his attire is red and white, and we know that there's uh, guardians of the crossroads that are red and white, that could be Ishu, and it also could be Shango. I'm, I'm seeing both Ishu and Shango in this video, but let's keep going. I didn't know it at the time. Okay, so during this part, he's walking, right? And this is his soul being free. And this is why he's dancing because he realizes he's no longer trapped by his body at all. He's ready to get up out of the earth realm and his soul is now free. He's dancing because his soul is happy. And in this part, he's literally ushering the 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 hearse to his funeral okay so let's keep going notice the cemetery in the background as well and we know the cemetery is also another crossroads point for our souls okay so this person is ecstatic about this and their soul is dancing let's keep going <laughs> Okay, 
right there. Y'all can see when he says, oh, you are the power over me and he falls back, right? So then his soul starts to transform and he's going up into the sky. And then you're going to see a shot on the video where there's a bird, hashtag bird watching bitch, right? Where there's a bird, that bird is his soul going towards the funeral home. That bird is his soul taking flight into the spiritual realm. Okay. So you, if you don't you know, look real closely, you might miss it that that's his soul. So let's keep going. Okay, this is my favorite part of the video because right now this is his soul going through all of the memories that he had with the love of his life, right? So this is also a video about soulmates, right? And just notice that every time his wife is depicted in this video, she is in Oshun's color. She is in yellow, okay? Sunflower colors. That's the colors that they're de depicting the wife in. And notice when they show him and the wife together, he's either in that sunflower color or he's in red and white as well. So let's keep going. Okay, so now he's going down the aisle and he's getting it, okay? He's literally getting it. When I see him dancing down that church aisle, it's the same church that he got married in. It's the same church that his funeral is taking place. When he's going down this aisle, his soul is like literally ecstatic. Like, come on, let's get into this casket. Let's go. All right, so let's keep going. I know what I want to do is make a man lose my mind. I thought about thinking it through. And every time I do, I find I want to make your dreams come true. I think I'm in love with you. Oh, I think I'm in love with you. I didn't know it at the time. I know okay, so now he's in his casket. He's looking around at his family members, his friends. They're all crying and they're all mourning. And he's literally happy to go. He's happy to get the up out of here, okay? So he's blowing kisses to the crowds. He's he's like, I'm out of here, okay? Let's go. I know what I want to do is make a man lose my mind. Okay, so we're going to pause again because now he's in the casket, right? Now he's in the casket and now his soul is going to the underworld. It's going up into the underworld, okay? So this is him transitioning for real, for real. Like after his funeral is over, now he's in the casket. Now his soul is like, boom, going to the next level. Let's see where he's going. Every time I do, I find I want to make your dreams come true. Come in. Now, notice when he gets to where he's going, it's like a party in his heavens. This this is the heavens that he's created. His wife is there. Notice what she has on again. She has on the color yellow. Okay, so I'm seeing, this is what I'm seeing. I'm seeing Shango and I'm also seeing Oshun and I'm seeing them coming back together in the spirit realm and partying and, and dancing together. Okay, now we do know that the spirit changes faces, right? Spirit does change faces. So I feel like when he first died, he was in the Ishu energy, right? And then when he crosses all the way completely over, he then goes into his Shango energy because he's going to go get his soulmate. He's going to go get his wife. He's going to go get his queen. She already died and she was there waiting on him. And now they can dance together forever. Let's take a look. Okay, so now we're looking at their their graves, okay? And now they're back together. And everybody else is still mourning in the video, but their souls are happy and they've reunited back together. So 
when I first seen this video, I immediately connected with it. Like I said, I was like in tears, crying. I watched it like 50 million times because it's such a beautiful like visualization of what happens when you cross over. This is so spiritual. I believe this is dedicated to his parents. I'm not sure. Sorry, Chris Stapleton, if this is not dedicated to your parents, but I, I believe this is dedicated to his parents. I do want to tell Chris Stapleton this though. I love and I mean, love, love, love the fact that you used African-American people in your video. Like that just made it even more like soulful. I don't even know. Okay. And I know that this is not a race thing or anything like that. I'm sure it's not, but I just, that's something that also draws me to the video. The fact that it's relatable to me and to my race of people, as well as any other race, because we know that Chris Stapleton is not black, but the whole thing is, is that he did use people of color in his video. Like basically the whole cast, okay. Was people of color. And that was something that I could really relate to as well. So I just want to thank Chris Stapleton for this beautiful work of art that he has decided that he was going to share with the world. It has touched my heart. It has touched my souls. And now I'm going to um, share with my subscribers and hopefully they will find joy in the song. Like I found joy in the song. It's such a beautiful song. And I want you guys to check out the video without the interruptions, without me talking over it, because it is so freaking good you guys it's beautiful share the video make sure you guys comment let you know him know that y'all coming from true gang over there saying on his video let him know like you know we we fucks with you okay chris stapleton we fucks with you over here in truth gang okay so i love you guys so so much i hope you guys like this reaction video do not forget to subscribe don't forget to put on your notification bell hit all the notifications you guys let me know if you like these reaction videos um if you want me to react to something i'm just now getting into it so y'all gotta tell me what it is you guys can send me um emails you guys can send me inboxes and if there's something that you would like me to react to um please try to keep it up like a a spiritual nature uh, or a, with a spiritual undertone to it because that's, you know, my area of expertise. But um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this. I love you guys so, so much. Hashtag truth gang, 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 gang. And don't forget justice for Alicia Smiley 2024. And I'm out this bitch.